Hey everybody and welcome to Race City Marine. Today we're going to take you on a tour of one of our brand new boats. This is our 2024 Super Aeronautique GS24. If you have any questions on this boat or our other inventory, take a look at our contact information down in the description below. This one has a really nice spec. You're going to see the anthracite metal flake on the hull. We also have haze gray as well as mystic white for the lower portion of the hull. And then moving to the upholstery, you're going to see tungsten gray along with a few more white accents. In back, you're going to notice right in the center we have the integrated surf pipe exhaust that's going to make it to where all the exhaust fumes bubble deep into the prop stream making it a quiet ride and your rider's not going to breathe in any of the fumes we have the ncrs wave plate as well to further adjust the trim and then on each side of the hull you're going to see nss which is nautique surf system these plates will protrude outwards just a few inches to further shape your wave and from a touch of a button you can go from left side riders to right side riders you're also going to notice the tungsten gray sea deck flooring all throughout this boat and i really love the rear facing seats really comfortable area to lounge out enjoy your time out on the lake with your friends and family we have a nice step to enter the boat and even your jl audio transom remote now sitting inside the gs24 this boat can seat 17 people you have a really nice wraparound seating configuration extremely comfortable to hang out with all of your friends and family so in back, one thing you're going to notice, the GS is a multi-purpose boat. So we have this retractable ski pylon that will pop upwards. Really convenient, you can then easily push it down and lock it into place. Great for skiing or tubing. For the engine, we have the ZZ5 from PCM Motor. This has 355 horsepower and 405 pound-feet of torque. And then on each side, we have huge storage lockers with the Pro Ballast System. So you're going to see the additional bags on top of the subfloor ballast. We have over 2,000 pounds of ballast in this boat, and that also doubles as a ton of extra space, so you can bring anything you need with you out on the lake. These are very easy to operate with a hinge and a gas strut. And then taking a look at the interior upholstery, gorgeous design, the center cushion right here, you can actually maneuver this in two different spots and use this as a table. It's a really cool configuration, prepare items, or even sit on it facing forwards or back. So it's a nice multi-purpose use for this bench. These two back cushions are both going to be on a hinge. On this side, you're going to see the dual battery system right here. And then on the other side, if we lift this up, we have an integrated cooler, even matches the sea deck flooring on your boat. The next two cushions will open this way, and we have a ton of hidden storage space. And you're going to notice all the floors are lined with more sea decking. That way, it's super easy to keep clean and keep dry. We have a battery on off switch on this side, as well as an integrated waste basket. And then one of my favorite features with the GS24 our rear facing seats. So this flat seat right here, you just pull this lever and now you can have a nice rear facing lounger to catch all the action behind your boat. On the passenger side, we have a really comfortable lounger seat. Of course we have speakers and grab handles. This cushion right here is also reversible. If we go ahead and lift this one up, you now have two rear facing seats, which is a cool touch. And this provides you with a leg cut up to where two people can honestly still sit in this passenger seat. We go ahead and close this down now. The cushion that I'm on right now, this whole passenger seat, you can also open it up and we have hidden storage space. You'll see the JL Audio subwoofer down below. We have the air dam sitting in here. That'll go in between the bow for those chilly days. And then up on top, you're gonna notice our glove box. It is lockable. When you open it up, we have the head unit for the JL system, along with quite a few different auxiliaries and a wireless phone charging pad as well. Onto the race inspired helm seat. This is a really nice design, and one of my favorite features, it will swivel, slides forwards and back, and you even have an adjustable bolster if you need that extra height. A cool feature with this seat, the way it's designed, you're actually able to sit comfortably sideways as well. With it locked forward, you can still keep your eyes ahead, talk to everybody in your boat, and even keep your eyes on your rider behind you. We have a nice mirror up on the top as well, and then on the right side, really comfortable armrest you're going to notice with a rotary dial with a ton of shortcuts to control the screen. Moving to the link pan array screen, we do have an awareness camera mounted on top of the tower where you can view what's going on behind your boat. You have a few vitals on this left side. You have audio controls and Bluetooth. You can see all five of the ballast tanks and their percentage. Then we have all the interior lighting and then a few more controls and vitals within the engine. We have the keypad below this with your horn, bilge, and blower, even the lockable keypad. Cup holder down below with another speaker, Really nice design for the three spoke steering wheel. We also have power steering on it, a slot over here for your phone, and you can even use that to hold your drain plug. There's a little bit of storage up here with two more USB ports. And then as we make our way to the bow, 
The GS24 is a really good size bow. There's a lot of seating. The bow, you have a more wide bow than traditional styles. So really comfortable to sit any which way you'd like. There's cup holders on the sides along with speakers and grab handles. And you're gonna notice more of the sea decking all throughout the bow. That way it's really easy to enter and exit from the front of the boat. Now all these seat cushions are removable. So if we pop this open, you can see more hidden storage space all underneath lined with more of the seat decking. That way it's really easy to keep clean and dry. The bow cushion will also open up for that extra storage space. Moving on to our bimini top, you can see just how large it is. It does a really good job shading you from the sun. It is collapsible. You just remove these arms, they'll velcro up in place, and the bimini will fold on top of itself to store. There's also surf pockets up there for those extra surfboards, and the entire flight control tower is collapsible. You have these lock and unlock levers, and then with the bimini folded, you can just fold the entire tower down and everything is nice in line with the windshield for easy storing or trailering. Now we do have a set of swivel board racks. Swiveling them inside, there are different ways to mount them for larger boards. You can also see all the rubber lining it, that way you're not gonna damage anything. And they have a nice spring assisted to give you a secure hold. With them outwards, all the water on your board is actually gonna drain outside of your boat, which is a great touch to see. We also have more JL speakers up on top. The awareness camera is located right here. Then we have our navigation light along with that ski pylon. But there is a full look at one of our brand new 2024 Super Aeronautique GS24s. If you have any questions on this boat, our new or used inventory, take a look at our contact information down in the description. And we look forward to seeing you all out on the water.